Okay, okay. We have a space monster. Now I'm gonna run for my damn life. Did somebody say Starbo? Hey, I'm Auburn. Welcome to 2018. I hope everyone had a good holiday season or good Christmas, good New Year's. Uh, I've been off for like a week or two. I just wanted some time off, you know, in the new year. Reset myself. Come back stronger than ever. I don't know anymore, but it's called Starbo. So it might be about a star and a bow. I literally have a ice pack between my legs right now too. This damn heat is killing me. Wake up, sleepy. Sleepy, wake up. Do I, do I move? Wow, riveting gameplay. 10 out of 10. Please subscribe. What do I do? Well, it's moving, so it's not, it's not glitching out or anything. Like I'm moving forward into the Starbo. Hello? Anyone? Please help. I guess while he's sleeping, uh, there's gonna be a few changes oh, to- Oh, damn you bitch. Hello. Leo Cornell. I'm about to tell you the story of a dead man's journey through, through, <laughs> through coughing and smokes. <coughs> I bloody died. And Mad. afterwards, I found myself stuck in a horrendously blue world. I've been dying to tell you this story, literally. Literally. So, sit Not back, figuratively. relax, and pay very close attention to my voice as I tell you how all of this began. Why don't you shut up, mate? Don't tell me what to do, you're not my real dad. Oh, damn. Them's are war drums. Welcome to Starbo. What was I saying? Yeah, some big changes coming this year. Um, hopefully I can start doing some, you know, facial cameras so you'll see this face more often. I don't know if anyone would want that, but it's something I'm planning to do anyway. Regardless of your input. A game by David Ornell Clint. Okie dokie. Is this guy some sort of like prisoner or badass or... Oh damn, look at this badass in the corner. Starring Michael Hall. And Michael Hall. Can I skip this? Like, I don't really want to watch him walking slowly. Well, it looks like we got some security personnel everywhere. I kind of look like a prisoner. Yeah, they don't trust me. It all started on a warm Tuesday morning in June. I was walking toward my boss's office as the doors ahead were slowly opened by his two valets. Ooh, is he like a That's my boss George. A hitman calls them called all of us his human robots. What an asshole, right? I'm a robot? Human robot? That doesn't make sense actually. Anyway, as I sat down in the chair opposite my boss, yes. This voice acting's pretty cool. It's a little, little bit believable. And quietly said with a smile on his face. Yes. Oh, the anticipation. Leo, you're fucking fired. Oh, sh**. At first, I was confused and couldn't really say anything other than... <laughs> you, look, you look very George, confused, mate. Thank you for this. But the moment George looked away and took a bite of his tremendously green apple, I said, George... Fucking retarded. <laughs> his smile on his face slowly faded. I happily left the room. Wow. Okay. Yeah, left the room running for his life. Before the goons come after me. I actually didn't read about what this game actually was about. Silly me. Usually I read the, you know, the Steam... The steam synopsis. A few hours later, I decided to move back with my beloved family in the Bahamas. Yes. So without letting anyone know, I bought the cheapest plane tickets I could find, packed my bags, and made my way over to the airport. I was going to spend the rest of my days together with my family. Perhaps start my own company and just live in the present. Why is the screen black? so well. Until I realized that the goddamn pilot was oh. fucking drunk. Oh, damn and it. high. He sang Do or Die while losing altitude, and, well, as you can see, the plane obviously crashed. Obviously. Into flames. That's cool. Is that how you died? That pilot died instantly, but I, well, 
Well, I could still feel the burning flames all around me as everything went. Oh, I finally! Found myself stuck in a shiny blue room. Ooh, pretty room. Luckily, I was freed soon by the door slowly opening ahead of me. Ah, you know what? This is a bit loud. I'm gonna change it. Hopefully, that's a little bit better. Oh, damn! It's bright. Can I? I can run, but I have stamina. That's all right. Let's just and save in that moment, the stamina. I began a brand new journey, an expedition through unexplored corridors filled with familiar beauty that I occasionally stumbled upon. Wait, so I crashed the plane. Well, we crashed the plane. Now I'm on a spaceship. Oh damn! The shadow scared the f out of me. I'm just gonna run. I don't have time to walk. This is crucial. Crucial uh, gameplay I'm missing out on. Journey uh, through space and time itself. We got butterflies. I'm assuming. Or little tiny. Oh, yeah, they're butterflies. I have, I have no joke for this. Ah, oh, pretty. So pretty. Pretty little butterfly. Can I, I can't do anything else. So how's everyone's uh, 2018 treating them? Everyone writing 2017 on the on the paper yet? Still. I know I have. You know, it usually doesn't feel like 2018 until about three months in. Which is kind of silly. I don't know what the hell I'm meant to be doing in this game. Just walking through a oh, freaking hell, man. Just walking through a spaceship. Very slowly. Open, please. Ah, okay. You gotta, you know, walk right up to the door. Was anyone getting sick of this blue yet? It's damn blue. And pretty, pretty sounds. Open, please. Open, please. Oh no. Oh no, there's a door over there. Okay. I thought I was. It's like, damn, I'm stuck already. Woo! That sounds like outside. No, is anything this way? No, nope, no. Nope. Okay, time to go out and play on the beach. Hopefully I have a lot of sunscreen. I get sunburnt very easily in, in space. God damn it! They're tricking me with noises and feelings. Do I die if I run out of stamina? Oh, wow. I'm going to assume I jump down. Bye. Why make me jump down and lose like half, more than half of my health? Lucky I'm a spaceman, I can regenerate really fast. This music's fairly nice. I'd like the soundtrack, please. Is anything actually going to happen in this game, or is... We're just going to run through corridors and talk crap with everyone. Talk about how good the, the tunes are. And how hot the weather is. And this ice pack that's melting between my legs. No, no, open. Like, I don't think there's any other... Funny, funny if I found another button. Like, you have found the button to play the game. Is this, a, is this an opening door? Yes. Not one of those non-opening doors. Am I right? Holy crap, I'm... Sincerely, uh, sorry for this gameplay. What a game to come back on. Can you believe it? Come back after a few weeks and give all my friends this crap. Oh, there's red down there. Bit, bit laggy. I found a computer screen. Soon, something somewhat familiar but horrendous discovered me as well. Hi. I realized Hi. then that there Hi. was more than Hi. to be found hidden in the corners of this new world. Oh. Oh, sh Okay, okay. We have a space monster. Now I'm going to run for my damn life. Space monster away. Uh, what's it say? You're strong. Thank you. Very kind of you. Oh, I hope this uh, space 
alien guys not fast? I don't think so. I haven't seen him yet. This is crawling through the vents. Look to your left. Oh, what to say? You'll get through this. Well, thank you. Man, these are really positive messages. What's the next positive message, please? I believe in you! Holy crap! This is like the most uplifting game I've ever played in my life. It's like if Shia LaBeouf uh, decided to make a game. Which would be pretty rad, yeah? Shia LaBeouf making a game. I wonder what kind of game Shia LaBeouf would make. I'm really reaching for our commentary here, guys. Well, there's two different ways. What's this way? Whoa! Something different besides corridors. Key? You found a key. What's that? Radio. Radio, radio. Roger one. Okay, let's go for this door. Oh, is it gonna be there? Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay. It's like a little mini War of the Worlds kind of monster. Kind of thing. This way. Is it weird that I kind of want... Lucky I have the key! It's kind of weird that I want the monster to catch me. Uh, okay. Like, I want to see what happens when monsters catch me in games. Again and again I had been rescued by doors. Doors that led further down into the mysteriously blue world. This the game is... Got, the more I started to distrust my surroundings. As they got even more and more unrealistic. This game's unrealistic. Ooh! Pretty. Is this sort of like a walking sort of discovery game? Kind of like... You know, kind of like Edith Finch kind of thing? Oh, that looks nice. Can I go down there, please? Why am I walking like an idiot? A walking simulator, that's what I'm trying to think of. Even though I've said the word walking a thousand times. I don't know, this game was like 16, 17 dollars US. So, it's not really impressing me that much at the moment. If it's a walking simulator, there's not much to, you know, walk or look at. Different colors! Yes, please. Thank you. Ah, damn. Turn turn down the brightness, please. The light, you're hurting my eyes. Oh. Oh, God. It's like I'm getting a little tan. The only thing right now that would make this game like, oh my God, 10 out of 10, would be like, oh, can I touch that electric, electric thing? Would be like a huge twist. Like, oh my god, twist ending! Find the key. Shit. Okay, I can do that. The first key wasn't very hard. So the second key shouldn't be that hard either. I didn't think I was gonna get lost, I thought they were just gonna hold my hand the whole time. Ah, oh, you bitch. Oh, hey, hello. What do we have here? A coach rack. There's a door. Oh shit. Are you friendly? Yes. Thank you. I don't know if this guy's friendly or not. I'm not hanging around to find out. Oh, there's another one in here. They're having a party! Oh yes. Oh damn! It. It's poison! Please help me, Mr. Robot. Is that killing me? Are you for real? Wait, was there like medicine in here? Can I have this medicine? No, damn it! He just wanted to hurt me. I wonder if they did that on purpose. Damn, green apple. That's why you don't have Granny Smiths. You just have the normal red ones. Like a normal human being. I gotta get to the exit. Find the exit. 
get out before the poison apple takes over. Yeah, I've, al I've always been curious about like doing the, the full face cam thing. You know, like FYI, uh, real talk. I'm not really confident in myself. So it'll be a big, it'll be a big deal if I do it. It'll be a big change if I do it. So hopefully everyone enjoys it. Seeing all my uh, shitty reactions. Holy crap, this looks cool. What is that? Kind of like water, but... The disbelief I felt for my surroundings did not stop me from continuing, though. No, it Quite doesn't. the opposite, actually. Can I get another apple for, like, health? I'll also continue to do uh, the horror game stuff, because I really enjoy playing the horror games. But I'm thinking of doing a few other different kind of games. Maybe trying out some retro games here and there, because I really love, you know, playing those old school games. You know, adding more retroness to the channel. Because I'm an old man, you see, so... The more... Some would say I'm retro. No, what? Oh, damn. Oh, damn, it's all opening! I can't... It's... Holy crap moly let's go this way. We've got a fireball demon. I don't know if it's, like, my computer. Oh, or the game. But it's very laggy. I don't know if I'm going to outrun this guy. Because he's running very slowly. If you couldn't tell. It's just like, let's go. I'm running out of, um, oh, Jesus. I'm running out of stamina. They haven't given me enough stamina. Go, 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 go. Go, please. Oh, there's no door. Ah, oh, you can't walk down the stairs. That's pretty cool. That's what you want in your monsters. You sort of want them not to, um, you know, walk down stairs. I wish I would heal. It's kind of unfair. Like, they put a delicious green apple on the chair and you eat it. And then it takes away some of your health for, like, the whole friggin' game. Ooh! Hi. Hello. That scared Hi. me. Ooh, should I just walk in the water? What the hell is this? Should I give him a foot rub? I can't really hear what she's saying. Lever. Oh! Okay. Ready, time reach, accepted, reset. Test. What? Okay, I got yellow, green, red, blue. Yellow, green, red, blue. Yay! Woohoo! Okie dokie, what kind of uh, weird crap are you going to show me in this this level, this scene? Should I save my my stamina for a monster? Am I walking on a lean? Ah, I kind of just want to run. If a monster comes, it comes. There's nothing I can do about it. Walking on a dream. Walking with a lean and a got a bum leg. Okay, it's running by itself. Whoa! Damn, look at this speed, mum! Okay, it stopped. <laughs> Sometimes I don't know if it's the game glitching out or like it's just meant to be that way. What's this game even mean? What's it trying to tell me? I don't know what's going on. These damn butterflies are all in the way. But we're gonna figure it out. We're gonna play it to the end. Oh, Mr. Robot. Sir, do you know what this game is about? Be nice if it wasn't a laggy piece of shit. But hey, I'm not here to, to judge developers on the games they make. Because I could not make anything uh, a quarter of this good. Holy crap. Epilepsy warning. 
Ah! My eyes! God damn it, warn me before you do that. Before you have a rave. Oh, we got some trash. Can I interact with the trash? Oh, that's cool. Uh, let's check these rooms for keys. Holy crap, I... I apologize for this. I might... I might just go on just to see... Because that's giving me a bloody headache. And we all know... And it's a fact... That headaches suck. Holy Jesus. I bet these robots are going to come to life soon. I have a funny feeling... Oh, am I back here? Oh no, it must be a different one, because there's a robot there, standing there, uh, pointing. Oh, he's showing his little son! Now you see there, son. That's what we call a tree. What's that for, Daddy? I don't f***ing know. What am I, a scientist? Yeah. Simba. Where's he pointing? Are they pointing at a specific thing? Why are all these robots stopped? And why are there monsters roaming around the corridors? That's my question of the day. Hopefully everyone can answer it in the comments below. A lot of flowers. Someone having a party or a funeral. Why does this key have a bad bed? <laughs> I'm here for you. I okay. I'm here for you too, baby. I didn't see a door. Ah, maybe this one. Yes. Was that door always there? Probably not. I'm gonna say no. I understand when, like, people try and make a game to make you think. You know, that kind of thing. But... I don't think this is the right setting for that kind of game. Just corridors. With like different shit inside the corridors every now and again. Like, oh, this corridor. Ugh, who's that guy? Is that me? Is that me in real life? Like, just because you put different stuff in corridors doesn't make it any less tedious. Like a chair. Are they trying to be like edgy and like confusing kind of thing? I could almost even hear George dropping that green apple in confusion as I once again oh, pass damn. through those dark corridors toward brighter times. Hello. There's a door here. There's an open cell. Oh no, it's not open. I thought it was open. So we got some green apple um robots. I'm assuming the green apple's got to do something with with something. That makes sense, yeah? That's a skeleton! Oh. Skeleton disappeared. Damn, is it Fight Club now? Is it time for- Oh, that's a red apple. The fuck? I just want to play with the train, man. Can I have the, uh... Let's just check in here. Is that another skeleton? Yep. Okay, the robots have taken over, everyone. The robots have taken over. And this train's gonna open up the door. Yes. To a key. A key to where? I have a key, sir. Please let me pass. Damn, just run right up to it next time. Hmm, was there something I can do in here? Can I unlock the... Dum. I was going to say, can I un unlock the piano? Damn, it's, it's pretty dark in here, please. What the hell's that? Why am I going so slowly? Oh, shit. Okay, cool. Oh, no, 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 no! Let me run faster! 
Okay, just kill me. Well, I'm going to leave it there, guys. Let me know what you think of this game so far in the comments below. I'll probably play it. I don't think it's a long game, so I'll probably play one more episode. I'm curious to see what the hell this game's about.